want my name? Uh, yes. Okay, my name is Mary C. Flores and I moved here back in 1979. Oh, actually our first home was that white one right there. Mm -hmm. And after we paid it off, we moved over here. We bought this one and we've lived here ever since. Uh, we've had several owners, several managers. Um, right across here used to be belong to CPS. There were no mobile homes here. And throughout the years, we have we've never really had any problems with with the managers or the owners prior to all of this. But we, one thing we did have a problem with has been the water constantly. But the thing is that back then they would read our meters. Now these new owners don't read the meters. They just charge whatever they think that two two people living in a household what what they should be charged and they go by that. And they're not really our meters are there. That's what I when I called this water uh, source to find out how that works. They said, well you don't have an account the the owner does so we can't tell you that. It's whatever he wants to charge. And I'm like, well, how is that fair to us when we're not using that amount of water, you know? So anyway, that's one of the things. It's like they were saying, they shut the water off. They don't tell us you're in the middle of a shower or trying to do something. And we're retired. My husband and I are retired. It's central to everything. That's why we've never moved. We have our doctors around the corner here. Everything, you know, where we go to buy, shop and everything, it's, you know, it's convenient to us and to have to be, if we were to be moved out or to relocate somewhere, they will, then that wouldn't benefit us. We were senior citizens on a fixed income and we couldn't afford to just go out and, you know, for them to put us somewhere. It, it, it would be a hardship for us if they did that. And um, we've lived here for so, so many years and We've just, this is our home. And um, another thing, this is a home for a lot of birds and our trees. You know, what are they gonna do? Come and raise all the trees, take them out? Where are the birds? You have cardinals here, you have owls here, you have all kinds of birds here. This is a bird path. So, I mean, I'm pretty sure that the bird lovers and the tree people who love trees would hate to see all this go. Because if they do do that, then all of this will be gone. And it, it won't just be the people that live here. It'll be, excuse me, it's okay. But, you know, it's just, it would just be a hardship if it was to come to that, that they would just come and tell us, that's it, you, you have to go. Mm -hmm. And like I said, 37 years is a long time to be in one place. And um, I always felt that when the time was right, if we could and we would, we'd move. But we've always felt comfortable here. And uh, we don't like to live beyond our means either. So we're going to live where we can afford. We're not going to be struggling. We have our, you know, so that's why we've stayed all these years. Our kids are grown. They have their lives. They went. We, they went to school, they had their good jobs, and I'm, I'm happy for that. They were raised here, they grew up, they went to the schools in the area. And like I said, this has been our home. Nobody's ever been interested in this mobile home park before, but yeah, like we have the river, we have the, um, the golf course across the street. Behind us is a uh, little league baseball field where my, my son grew up playing ball. So all of this is, you know, and our churches around and everything. So I don't know. That's what what more I can say. But this is our home, and, and I don't feel that they can just come and just tell us, you know, we're we're taking it, and you all need to find something else. Thank you.